Hey everybody, welcome to this special segment of Bring Your Child to Work Day. My name is Chris Paparo, and I'm here with two of my good friends and fellow volunteers, Mary Brown and Zena Zinich. We're here at Team Velvet Inc. in Flemington, New Jersey, to share with you something special. Team Velvet was an HSBC award grant recipient for two years running, and a large crew of us came out and got to meet the horses, work on the farm, and help out all around. Today is an absolutely glorious day. It's the first day of spring. It's a few days before our actual event, but we wanted to bring something back to you all from the country and something special. So with that, we're gonna introduce you to three special horses, and then also introduce you to Dr. Susan Edwards, who will talk about her program, how she helps children, and how the past year has been for her. My name is Zina Zinich, and we're here at Team Velvet. Velvet here is the lead therapy horse, and he is quite spectacular. He's very intelligent, very intuitive, and even likes to play games. Maybe later we'll be able to see him roll a ball, play soccer, or even use his feet to play the piano. Hi, I want to introduce you to Precious. She is also a therapy horse and likes to greet people with a curtsy. Hi, I'm Mary Brown, and this is Annie. And Annie is the smallest of our horses, but that doesn't mean she's any less spectacular. Now, during COVID, she has been learning how to sprint. And maybe later on, she'll do some sprints for us. She loves to get hugged. So Okay, and now we'd like to introduce you to Dr. Susan Edwards, the psychologist director of Team Velvet, Inc. Hi, I'm Dr. Susan Edwards. This is Velvet, as you've met, and uh, I thank you so much for joining us today. These therapy horses work with children who have trauma. I'm, I designed the, the program to help the child, children 5 to 12 who may have had a terrible loss. Someone they loved died. They might have been in, in a car accident. They might have had uh, a terrible uh, thing happen to a loved one. So they come here to the farm, we design a treatment program for them, and the horses are a co-therapist for me, they're a friend to the child, and all three of these horses give a tremendous amount of love to children. Um, we have activities, which you will see in a few minutes. Um, we always do something fun. We have a learning component, so that sometimes if something bad happens to a child, just like we were showing earlier, Velvet has learned to improve his twirl. Annie has learned to improve her, her racing, her uh, sprinting. Sometimes when something bad happens to someone, it's very therapeutic. It's a very good thing to try to turn that into something positive that helps others. So sometimes we've had children here who've made a book for other children who had a parent die or other children who've had uh, uh, been through a terrible accident, or they've written a poem, or they've written a card to the horses. All the horses have cards that say, thank you for helping kids. Now, we recently cleaned the barn, and so not everything is back up again on their stalls, but it's very special. Thank you. So this is Annie, and she's been practicing her sprint, so we are going to show you how she does that. Stop the 
boy and you'll come here. You reach out. Okay. Go ahead. Here is the costume section of our program today. Here is Precious, who is dressed as a ballerina. Her costume was made by a young girl and her mother who worked with Precious to teach her some dance steps. Here is Annie, dressed in a pink hat with a matching pink dress, and she just looks cute. And the children smile when they see her. And here is Velvet, dressed as a cowboy, enjoys dressing up. All of our therapy horses do things to make children smile. And they originally started dressing up as a result of a fundraiser that we had. People donated fabrics to us. We made outfits for the horses, and the horses modeled them. And that was our first fundraiser. The horses enjoyed it very much, and so we still have them dress up on occasion and have many boxes of clothes. Thank you. 